<laughs> yeah, this is quite one off the internet. Wow. What's up, everybody? I am some guy named Nate. Um, video game, video game, video game. I'm shutting my door really quick. Uh, this is powered by Unreal, and it is about driving fruits and getting the big, the big trophy. The big trophy from the banana people. What the hell is that? Oh crap! Ooh, loud! Whoa, loud! Okay, her spidey senses sit tingling, and now she's racing with her pineapple cannon and dubstep. She will defeat all the other racers. Have you ever played a game that was a phone game that they ported to a home console? I've done multiple times. Okay, cool. I don't need to see the rest of that. Hello, everybody. I'm some guy named Nate. This is one off theater. I'm playing All Star Fruit Racing. I'll probably beat the rest of this game off camera. But for the next 20 minutes, you're going to see me sit through a loading screen because that's how long this loading screen is, apparently. Good lord. I was going to play fun things today, but no. There we go. Apple Island. Do kids actually get stuff like All-Star Fruit Racing for Christmas and stuff? I sure hope not. Welcome to All-Star Rural Fruit Racing. Want to start the tutorial? Yes. Lime is one of the most used fruits in American cuisine. Hey, it's giving us, like, fruit trivia. Ooh, this shit's loud still. Hey, whatever. It's fine. If we get Echo in... Oh my god! Look at that orange guy. He's having a great day. Three. Two. One. Let's learn the basic commands. Right trigger to accelerate and control stick to move. You got it. L2 to drift, and... What the hell? There's a, this is a, this is the taunt button, ready? Let me, let me park really quick, ready? Okay, okay, oops. Pressing... Uh, buh, 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 and buh helps you watch around from different angles. Let's try. Left, right, down. Okay, cool. First person is up on the D-pad. Nice. This is fun. If I was stuck in fruit hell, oh, this is probably what happened. So, if I hit the touchpad, it warps me to the starting line. Uh, press L1 to use your horn. That's what I was doing. I didn't think that, oop. I didn't think that the weird <laughs> was a horn, but okay. Pressing L2 while accelerating will begin your drift. Let's try drifting for 1.5 seconds. Okay. There we go. I said to be completely out of control. Release uh, left trigger and the cart will accelerate. Like that. You get a little bit of a boosty boost. In addition to speed bonuses, you can release the, release the drift button past these terrifying humans. Nice. Nice. This is giving absolutely zero feedback. To hit the gauge in the bottom of the screen, orange is likely to slow your cart down. Oh, so if you drift too long. Man, come on. I'm just going to whip it around the whole corner. We're just going to drift the entire of trip. So yeah, if you drift too hard, your engine explodes. That makes sense. Chapter 3. Welcome. Let's learn to manage the juicer system. Uh, collect the fruit bubbles and then click right stick to use a special. Oops. Grapes of Wrath. Delicious. Oh, this is gonna be like Lego. It's gonna be like fucking uh, Lego Racers. You know, we got some banana. Ooh! Some more banana. Yes, I'm aware of all the bananas. Oh crap, I missed my bananas. And then that's your special weapon, Katung. By pressing, uh, 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 you can disconnect or have any relevant fruit tank locking and you will not use the juice inside the tank. 
Try to disconnect a fruit tank. Okay. There we go. Kind of weird. Is this like the big plot twist? <laughs> Three or four fruit tanks full. Looks like we need watermelon. There we go. Uh, ice cubes. Anytime you choose two special blah, 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 blah. fill three fruit tanks and then disconnect one of them to use a special move. Okay. This is the shittiest tutorial I've ever seen. Okay. There we go. Why do you have to click the right stick though? That's, that's really... When all fruit tanks are full, you can unleash some hell. What happens if I just screw the system? There we go. And then I'll screw the system the other way. Guess what, hose? Looks like that's a, it's a red shell. What? No trophy. No trophy for doing the tutorial. Offline. Career. Oh man, riveting story on Coconut Fred's Fruit Salad Island. This reminds me of that fucking uh, candy verse. From, uh, what's it called? Uh, man, there's a lot of quirky people in this universe. Uh, who are you? I'm thinking this game is for girls. Ugh. Guess they're each represented by a fruit. Uh, Gwendolyn's kind of cool. She got that kiwi blast. That's fruit. That's what I'm going to call my uh, Let's Plays from now on. Is when you don't play a video game, you just eat a bowl of fruit. And listen to funky ass music. You guys know how funky this is? Yellow soft fruit. With random juice. Okay, we're good. Super duper. Man, this is terrible. I'm just gonna point out everybody that I only spent 99 cents on all-star fruit racing. Whoa, that sound effect was obnoxious. Everyone's like, why do you have this on your, uh, on your game list? Woo! There you go. Gotta scratch my back really quick. Do you not even do tricks? Well, that's scary. It's like the, what's that song? It's like, You know what I'm talking about? You probably, you guys probably do. Ooh, are you nauseous yet? Dude, come on. Try not to get last place. I want to get first place even. This would suck to be in this hell. Woo! I don't even know what these power-ups do. But I'm using the power of my kiwi. I'm, I'm talking about the fruit, of course, not the bird. <laughs> nice. See, I should get a bonus. For being fucking cool. There we go. I was kind of off track there for a second. What difficulty are these computers on? Oh man, we have the big orange. There you go. Man, the big orange is just nauseating. Also, the big orange is uh, my wrestling name. Oh shit. Will you guys stop? I'm in fifth place now. Seven. Really? All that for a snowball? Oh, and then I got hit by another thing without warning? Alright, cool. Kiwi power. Also, the Kiwi power sucked. I don't know if you guys noticed, but it looked like nothing fucking happened. And again, I don't know if any of the- hey, look, Coconut Rushmore. There you go, see? 
Risking it for the biscuit should give me a big boost. But it fucking doesn't. Get out of here, pineapple girl. I don't need to memorize these damn characters' names. Okay, whatever this is. Okay, this is kind of working. There we go. I'm back in first, finally. I think the computers just let me win. There we go. Hey, oh, the perfectionist. Look, she's rocking out. Can't stop her. There you go, these creepy creatures. They are so, and my phone's buzzing. They are so happy about my victory. How is this copywritten? Go to the next race. Oh, we're only 11 minutes into this. This is okay. The Coca Nui. Alright, that's okay. The Coca Nui tribe is uh, very good friends to my people. Holy shit, this game's loud. I don't know how this is gonna be in post. This isn't gonna get uploaded for a while. So I'm not too upset. Oh crap, you guys are taking all my fruits! Nice. And guess what? And guess what? Yeah. I don't even need to drift. I got great handling. You can't handle how good I am at handling. I also didn't go back to first person, but I'm okay with this camera angle. First person's fun though, like this. Oh cool, I'm on airbender. Nice. Oh, she defended it. Oh, damn it. What the hell does Melon do again? This kind of works. Give me that boost. This is the power of Kiwis, guys. You just you take a spoon and you cut a Kiwi in half. It's just great. It's delicious. Gives you a big speed boost in not only the race, but in life. Yep, I'm actually gonna drift. Whee! Let's try the other path. Just for shiggles. Whee! That was so freaking fun, you guys. On the edge of my seat, dog. Ooh. Nice, we got a snowball, but not good enough. There we go. I know I'm just focused on the, how good this game is, you guys. I'm a great girl. She is delicious. She, she makes her own Mott's juice. It's like Monster High, except they're all made of uh, fruits. Woo. And obviously this route was way better, so... Woo. Yeah, the banana is the best power-up. Why would you not collect anything other than a banana? Deja vu! What the hell? These three mega ju juices in a three-lap race. Okay. <laughs> What a great video game. Come on, I can't skip it. That's okay. With the powers of Kiwis. I have won. Again. Give me the next race. What's the most expensive fruit in the world? The Yubari King Melon. Why don't you tell me how much those are, video game? The... The Junglananas? Junglananas? You were really stretching for a pun for banana that you couldn't... You just couldn't... This one's a five lapper, wow. <laughs> uh, 
That's okay. We. All right. Which route do we take? Let's take this one. Nice. And this sick jump, man. I thought that we'd just be getting sick jumps the entire time, but no. This is like Paw Patrol. I beat one of the Paw Patrol video games a long time ago, and it was basically uh, a racing game, but it was like an everyone wins racing game. So it was really, 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 really obnoxious. And I wasted my tornado. And look, guys, this is how uh, smoothies are made. She took my item. Item. Alright, I'll take the upper coconut path. I'm feeling like it's better. That that beat though. That beat is pretty good. Nice. It's metal is shit, man. I sure hope that I've, I'm gonna have fun for the last five laps of this event. Oh, it's, a speed boost is fine. I'll take a speed boost. And I, I forgot which path I took. Damn it. Oops. That one didn't even play the whole song. And the answer is that path sucks. Man. It's weird though, because usually with uh, tracks that split like that in most normal racing games, uh, they're both about the same length. So it's just like an illusion of option kind of a thing, which I like better. Give me that ice shield. My dogs are barking, I don't know if you can hear it. I thought I had an ice shield video game. Mm -hmm. And the physics don't know what to do with the big coconut rocks. This the watermelon girl it does not know how to fucking turn. Oh, and she doesn't know how to fire tornadoes either. You totally missed that one. Well, it's gonna be a no from me, dog. Okay, and we have learned that short route right through here. Nice. And then I'm a waterbender, and I forgot that's a heat seeker, so that was worthless. Yeah, most of these are heat seekers. They're spawning for you. It's not like. There's a drop. It's not like most video games when you're in first place and, uh. You know, oh, hey, good job, kid. Yeah, you're in first place now. Here's a banana or something. Like, nope, good luck. Woo. And guess what? We still have two freaking laps of this crap. Whee! That's okay. And there's not even, like, you know, something normal, like saying, oh, hey, good job. You're on, you know, two laps to go. It's just like, oh, you're supposed to know that. Hopefully all the kids that played this and got this instead of like Mario Kart or Crash Team Racing. I hope they enjoyed it. Because, damn. And I'm missing everything. I miss you. Don't waste your time on me. I think I hit my own power up there too. Most of the computers do not know how to tackle this racetrack. Which is weird because you'd think that the computers would know how to do a racetrack if the they were programmed by the developers, you know, to do the race, and that's it. They exist for one purpose, and it's to go around this these tracks over and over and over and over and have the best fucking time while driving around the exact same racetrack over and over and over. Stuck in fruit hell. I could have bought so many more video games, but I instead bought All-Star Fruit Racing. If I'm not mistaken, I think there's two of these. Which is really weird to me. That the studio did... That they were just like, oh, dude. We did such a good job with All-Star Fruit Racing 1. We've got, we got to make a sequel, dog. We've got to... 
The people need a sequel. Is this the shield? Even though it lasts like eight seconds. Swag. Yeah, this is dated for 2017. I'll have to look at how many freaking weird Chivos I got. Nice, and across the line. What? I don't get another pointless trophy for that? Yep, just gonna kick my feet up. Okay, I guess I wasn't gonna kick my feet up for much longer. Okay, let's just skip that. I don't know what the hell was gonna happen, so it's fine. Are those pistachio people? The pistachio people are my subordinates. There's another race. Strawberries are made of 90% water. Oh, the apple pikes. You gotta be careful when saying the name of this track. Let's go. And this is probably one of the worst uh, racing games I've ever played. And I missed the tornado. How did I miss the freaking tornado? There we go. Nice. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, am I in second place? Also, that lady totally missed. Man, come on. I keep getting Kiwis, and well, I guess that's my specialty. And look, the, even the computer. What the hell? Oh, it's probably a power up or something. She just crashed right into a wall. Whoever is this, like, Lemon Jello? What the hell are you? Come on, Lemon Jello. Yeah, I don't know how anyone can have fun with this. I'm trying my hardest to have fun with this. I hope this is the last race of the tournament, and I can say I beat uh, All-Star Fruit Racing on the show. Yeah, sometimes it's just fun to go to, like, the eShop or the PlayStation Network or the Xbox Store, sort it by what is the cheapest, and then just go from there. Sometimes doing that is a huge mistake. Sometimes it can lead to funny stuff like this. This is again, 99 cents, everybody. You cannot complain for 99 cents. What's this do? Oh, that's what it does. We got the tornado. And now we got the fruit salad tornado. And now we got the big shield. You see, you, you just stack items on items. This isn't like LEGO Racers 1, when it's actually kind of fun to stack items in a weird way. Speaking of which, I wish I could record LEGO Racers 1. It's one of those games on the N64 when, like, it will just go to a black screen on your recording software. I don't know if I can try outputting it through HDMI and it'll change that. But at this moment in time, holy crap. And look, I don't even have to drift. The computers are just... I don't know what to do. Oh, no! I like how I was insulting the computers and then... She passed me and then immediately turned right into a wall. There you go. Oh shit, she has a tornado. Oh shit, gigantic snowball. See, the weird part is this isn't even like... You don't feel like you're flying. You just feel like, oh, okay, cool. I don't care how many times you laugh, lady. I'm not laughing. No! No, it's not funny! Nobody's laughing! That's my favorite angry joke quote. <laughs> and then is that fucking blue? It's blue. You want me to pay $20 for blue? There you go. Now I have a tornado of my own. What are you gonna do about it? No! There we go. Yeah, get out of here. Yeah, I'm back to a tornado, so 
Hopefully no one tries passing me. Okay, that's fine. Somebody left a big grape in the way. Also, one of the best uh, kart racers that's not uh, this game, or like a Mario Kart or something, is called Coffin Dodgers. I know it's on pretty much every system. It's really bizarre. Oh shit. It's uh, a game about like a retirement community, and like death is like, hey, I'm setting up a kart racing tournament, and whoever loses, I'm totally gonna annihilate. And it's really, really fun. I've beat it like twice before. It's pretty dang decent for an uh, indie kart racer. Unlike what you're seeing on your phone or computer or whatever the hell you're watching this on right now. Tight corner. There we go. There we go. I wonder why watermelon is flashing. Did I not collect enough watermelon? Oh, that's what I did. I accidentally hit X and I've turned off watermelon. When did I hit X to turn off watermelon? There we go. Hopefully that was the end of that tournament. All-star fruit racing, all-star fruit racing, rock out fruit racing. We're gonna rock out. Woo! Are you sure you want to confirm? What the hell kind of sentence is that? Are you sure you want to confirm? Sure. Hey! Coconut by the shore. The coconut cup we golded. Two miles. Hey, that that bumped us up a trophy level. Well, good job. Good job, all-star fruit racing. You help me out. We got new cart customization options. And we got more cart customization options. Let's customize our shit really quick. New tires. And we got the Papaya Grove, which looks like a maple leaf. So it's in Canada? Okay, let's go to the garage. Uh, oh, man. Let's look at our freaking sweet car. Um, vehicle. Oh, we can change the look. <coughs> of it. Man, I'm drunk. That one's pretty good. And then <coughs> body. Uh, oh, we can customize the paint. Okay, fine. Neon green. And purple. And blood, blood red. And make it chrome. Nice. Wheels. Uh, let's make those Frickin' knobby. Wait, no, we can change our wheel color? Our wheels are gonna be black with neon green highlights. There we go. And this car kicks ass. Rims. Uh, we got this with like the slots in them or normal. Uh, let's make these, let's tie it in. Let's make it purple. We gotta do the dark purple right here. Yeah, that looks nice. And then these are also gonna be chromed. And then front mask, we only have normal. And aerial antenna, let's go to... I think we unlocked some silly ones. Like we unlocked an eight ball or something. An avocado is not a fruit. Well, I mean technically. Sure, I'll put an avocado on it, I don't care. And then what? That's not obnoxious. This is me when I uh, see delicious pizza in front of me. <laughs> oh no, I have to get to ready for work. Actually, let's make a story out of this, guys. Ready? Oh man, uh, my uh, captain is here. And a clown. Oh shit, a semi truck's gonna drive over the clown. I think there's a tiger in him. No, look out for that cow! And sheep! And rooster! You're under arrest for having all these animals. I'm gonna eat them. Okay, everybody. Uh, save. Over the empty slot. Did, did that save? Uh, yes. Cool. Alright, everybody, that was All Star Fruit Racing for the PS4. Um, will I ever play this game again? Maybe to just quickly beat it. 
I would play through the rest of the cups, but kind of crap. I don't think even like a child would enjoy All-Star Fruit Racing. Just give them Mario Kart or Crash Bandicoot or Forza or Gran Turismo or something. But that being said, thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to see you in the next fruit salad. Yummy, yummy.